Hello, boys and girls. Happy New Year. <laughs> I'm not in their mood. You know you, you are all social, so everybody has been insulting me. I don't feel like Happy them. Happy New Year. <laughs> yes. Happy Valentine's Final. Day. Happy yeah. Valentine's Day. Month. Happy New Year. <laughs> Which other one again? Merry Christmas. Merry, no, uh, uh, Christmas. We tried for them now. No, we did. <laughs> I just want to ask you guys why you don't have joy. They lack joy. They don't have any joy. They don't believe in rest. Someone sent me a message that, do you know that they've listened to an episode from 2017? That is this my plan <laughs> for them to be listening to old things. Anyway, we're back, baby. Yeah. Okay, now that we're back, I want to see what you guys are going to do after all the hype. In have the you guys, did you guys even say to yourselves, oh, I wonder how FK is doing. Let me even send Mba. No, 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 no. no. Nobody cares about that. How are doing? What so, so, are cho, doing? Cho, 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 why you're not coming back? You don't think we have anything to do? No, no. We're here for their pleasure and their pleasure alone. But in the words of Bob Brisky, we're about to take Somebody over. Somebody says to now, you say we don't take you seriously. Continue. <laughs> <laughs> no, we actually need to send some of the... We have to seriously, post some I'm of the messages. put it together. <laughs> some of the messages. <laughs> Ridiculous. So, oh, this afternoon, actually, I got a message. Or was it this morning? No, it was this morning. And someone was like, she had a dream about the two oh, of what? us that were fighting. I'm not joking. I'll show what? you. And maybe that she's wondering if maybe that's why the podcast is not back. Yet. Okay, that but like that having a scoreboard, mm, right? No issues. <laughs> it is ensemble cast, I suggest. <laughs> oh, what is to be dream? This episode is brought to you by Flutterwave. Flutterwave is an amazing payment services platform. You can do a bunch of other things apart from receiving and sending money across the world. If you are a business owner, small or big, you can create invoices, you can create a mini website. They have basically gone out of their way to create different solutions for different types of individuals and businesses. So if you're wondering how to create a unique um, payment solution for you and your company receive payments and send payments across the world try Flutterwave today all right back to the episode anyway yeah. how are you happy new year are you sick i saw yesterday <laughs> who keeps it can't you just go with the whole thing okay, for yeah, the yeah, people? happy new year i'm okay what is what is this year how is 2022 for you so far i don't mm. like your, your facial expression that's number one I don't know. You don't know how the year is. I don't know how it is. Are you not yet. present with us? I am, okay. but it's not really giving yet. Really? Mm, not mm-hmm. yet. Okay. Not Fair yet. enough. But I am optimistic. But what was your like? Giving. Did you do like um resolution? So the two of us last year, did we not say we're not doing resolution again? Anything I that didn't was do, so I'm just asking, you know, Maybe you were deceived. I don't know. Sherry, I saw <laughs> you on New Year's Day. We, we were at the same party. <laughs> so I don't know which time we would have done the resolution. No, I don't. But maybe don't, later on. I don't have, just generally, I do want to be like a more cheerful, like happier person. Good. <laughs> Are you sick? <laughs> That's one. No, one I thing I've done good. well, I've started doing well already is when people invite me to things. Okay, I you say I've started, started going, which is good. Mind you, I have to bring this up yesterday. Oh, Mommy, because now she, she said claims to be listening to this podcast. That's why yesterday I got a call. I, I was like, please, who's calling me? <laughs> Mommy's PA just said, please, please, please. I need your last number. I said, I don't get. She said, I'm outside her house. Your mommy told me to drop an invitation to her for her. I said, I don't get. <laughs> you guys, I'm now part of a chemistry Imagine family. mommy I'm had so told happy. me to come and meet her at some event. Before I know it, the PA is calling me out. Oh, they dropped a, a, an invitation for July. I said, who is that? Yes. And it's, why is Mommy sending her invitations they invite, The to family her invites home. me to everything now. It makes Only me so happy. Only for me to get them. Mommy said, I want to Excuse me. <laughs> okay? Excuse me. First of all, I didn't see any physical invitation. And this is the rubbish you that I... You didn't need a physical invitation. This is rubbish invitation. I hate. You didn't need a physical invitation. Let me tell you something. You guys, Faye Kemi's parents, her family, they invite me to everything now. In fact, the assumption is almost like I'm in the group chat. It's very confusing so, to sometimes me. Sometimes stuff will happen and Faye Kemi will be like, I don't think anybody has told Jola that... You guys are expecting her. Ah, I'll just be sitting down. Someone just say, jealous. excuse me, are Look, you guys aware Fake that don't be she's jealous. not in this home? Don't be jealous. Okay, we are with ourselves. Fake me, cousins are my cousins now. Those little kids, they are the best. I've not seen the Agbaya Yadin on TikTok <laughs> with them. Rubbish. Your cousins encourage they me. They are laughing at they you. They encourage me. They're not like you. It's fine. So these are some of the things that are happening this year that I'm not 100% sure about. But you sure do. About. I was your only looking like. I didn't do it. I did words for the year. Did you do that thing? It's no. Kumbi's fault. No, no. Please feel free. Kumbi, Kumbi posted one thing about her word for the year. And mm-hmm. I was like, you know what? I'm getting into it. Mm-hmm. And then I couldn't pick one. So I picked four. You know, I'm a pastor's child. So when you say word for the year, it usually okay, means... Okay, it's usually like... Them say, it's always rhymes. It's always like... Wait. Mm. Um, 
Mm-hmm. Wait now. <laughs> wait now. Wait, wait, wait. Let me, um, it's coming to me. The Holy Spirit is currently doing ministration now. Mm-hmm. Ministration mm-hmm. now. I've gotten it. Mm-hmm. Mm. 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 Hope nothing will fail. I am me. coming <laughs> up with it. Do you think it's easy to have a word for the year? No, no, please go Does ahead. Does Spirit speak to you? No, How will you feel know free. Feel the free. process? No, feel free. Let me tell you what it is. It will be like. No. <laughs> So, and hey, it will be like double blessings for you in 2022. <laughs> That's always the word for the year. Ah, but can we please? A year of plenty, 2018. It's always, everything <laughs> always lines up. Trust me. Interesting. Without that, it can be. I don't actually have this thing. Maybe I should start. I'm doing with double blessings for you. I'm um, no thank 2022. you. 2022. No, thank you. That's a word for I the want year, my own guys. Word. You Double can keep blessings for no, it's for the people. Okay. Double blessings for you in 2022. That's but you, it. what are your own words? You my words four. were okay. Let me tell you my words. My words were ease. ease. You know the thing. I'm actually too fine for a lot of the stress that I go through. I've okay. realized that like, I'm actually made for a soft mm-hmm. life, I and I thought you. back to times where my life was just soft, relaxed. You know someone that said it, fully paying for it precisely. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? So I was saying to me that, see, yeah, it's soft, babe. Don't you trust trusting yourself. Because I was, I, I, came, I went somewhere mm-hmm. and then he was like, oh, let me help you with this. And I was like, oh, no, 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 you know, let me try. And he said, no, 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 it's soft, babe. And you know, I said, you know what? <laughs> you are correct. And so since then, je, je, ni munshi. That's it. Mm. Just moving je, je, li. So ease. I don't see even have any, any stress, anything. Anything else to happen. So no problem. So ease. Mm-hmm. Is number one love. I've said that this year I'm falling in love. Fake is a fucking lion, a dirty bitch. Let me tell you why. Okay. You guys, you don't need to do. I've been, oh, I've been rolling with fake. I think fake me too many times a week now. Like now it's bad. It was bad Fuck before. Sake. Now it's worse. So I hang out with her a lot. Fake me has been rejected. This love. <laughs> You don't. She has been rejecting love left okay. and right. You don't always have to tell everybody. No, I just don't want you to happening. lie. No, what I mean is that mm-hmm. I'm not, and you know the problem that you're putting me in, you don't know it. <laughs> because when this podcast comes out now, somebody will now phone me that, sorry, which love are you? Are you saying one person? Rejecting. Is it, is it my, excuse me. me. <laughs> no, 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 keep going. Anyway, like so you I want said, to start the this this season of the podcast with lies. Like I said, this year, right? I'm joining all these we 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 were doing. What, when you just say, well, "What am I up to?" I say, "Oh, we're you know we're going." I was out talking tonight. to someone that I know. Like we're not we're not close enough to be friends, but we are like cordial and stuff. So I was like, "Oh, so what are you doing tomorrow?" Just you know, make being. Yeah. So she's like, "Oh, so my man and I, I say." Uh-huh. That's what I want to start to be saying. Now. I said, "Where are you?" So, uh, that's what I'm telling you. That by before the end of this year, now, so so my man. I actually I hate the term my man. You don't like it that. Really what do you me what do you like? I don't know, but like it won't be my man. But I'm going to be annoying in a different way. Yeah, this one. Oh, I love it. This one. What? Really? I love this one. I love... That's what I'm going to be doing. But anyway, like I said, this is my year of love. I'm leaving the streets for one good. One of my older... She's... I, she, if she was like my dad's friend, she would be like an older friend. Yeah. So technically, she's not like a... She would be like a grand aunt. She's a very much older friend because your father is... A yes, guest. I know. But she was like, oh, Jala, like, um, do you... Do you think you are going to like date this year? you think you're going to have your boyfriend do you know she said do you think you're going to date this year and i said yeah she said no serious relationship i said yeah that would be nice to have your boyfriend then she started laughing right <laughs> <laughs> i was like sorry auntie what's going on she was like so you mean you're going to be 30 and you'll be saying my boyfriend <laughs> do you know that i find do you know that it's actually not funny because i thought about it yeah that is someone was saying it that like at a big, big age, next thing will be saying, oh, this is my boy. Excuse me. Excuse <laughs> and do you know me. the thing that made it funny? She laughed too, like tears were coming out of her Do you know that eyes. older people find the whole concept yeah, absolutely so foolish? It's 
are you marrying him or not? Yeah. If you are not, then what's the so what the should I, deal? She said, what should I call him? She said she doesn't know, but it would just be very funny if I say to her, it my sounds boyfriend. So much to me, I'm having a boyfriend. My cousin is 16, so he's having but It's somehow, <laughs> it's somehow, we need to come up with a new... Anyway, like I said, this is my year of love. love how was Valentine's Day? Do let's mind our business. <laughs> just in general. Okay, after you, you've opened my... No, how was Valentine's Day? What it was you good. I didn't do... I didn't go or do... Go anywhere. Okay. But it was good. What did you receive? Things. Like what? Just things. From who? Um. So I want to send you things. Let me tell you something. My idiot ex <laughs> said... Sorry, I, fool. I saw his... <laughs> <laughs> a big fool he sent me a message he was like oh <laughs> so this is two years in a row nothing for you I said first of all <laughs> I said no I received gifts eh? like corporate gifts so. <laughs> and that was really really that that made me laugh like he's such a fun fun funny person incidentally I laugh. spoke to my exes on Valentine's Day I don't know why no. Um, yeah who sent you things you didn't tell us I will tell you but I won't Why you not? Okay, what did you get? Just things. Like what? Things. Like what? Things. Like, what were the things. things? What? Things. Did you get flour? Did you get yes. chocolate? Did you get yes. a hamper? What did you get? This and hamper, like a gift box. Uh, this and you pants. No. <laughs> <laughs> no, but a few Valentines ago, one of my best friends, do you know Chamaka? No. Okay, so Chamaka. <laughs> Chamaka um, is in our, in our group of friends. You can't. You really can't predict yeah, the kind of things that go through her mind because she's of all of us, she's the most cheerful. Yeah. She's the most like encouraging. She's the most so we had like a sleepover. And Chema was like, okay, guys, I have something for you. And you know, with Chema it can be Bible verse, it can be food. You just don't know. And for all of us, she brings out pants. <laughs> <laughs> and not normal pants. Like none of the pants was complete. Oh, like all these it's it's not even lingerie. Lingerie is you know have you seen have you had a raunchy pants yeah. before? All the pants with holes. Bro <laughs> like, all of us were like she's trying to help you. All of us were like, first of all, I'm like, what is this? Like the one I picked up like catapult. And because I was my reflexes were slow, so I got there late. So my friends had picked the presentable things, like in him. And every time I see it, have you used it? I, of course, I've not used it. Why now? I don't like pants like that. <laughs> it doesn't work. Like to me, pants should serve a purpose. Okay, <laughs> it doesn't make any sense. But it, that's one of the one of my. It's such a random thing, and it's one of the fav- my favorite gifts ever. Because whenever I see it, I legit yeah. bust out. Who was laughing. it that gave us? Actually, no. Well, my friend has a brand. They sell like loungers. So she yeah. gave all of us pants and other types of pajamas that Ooh. are, quite frankly, not supposed to be worn for more than 30 minutes mm. at a time. Mm. You, you know, do you know one so thing? So she was explaining to us that the essence of it is for it to be taken off. I said, okay, I'm <laughs> bad job. Because <laughs> explain to me why I should be wearing all these lace materials. Or the one where like, so sometimes people will buy, so they'll say, they'll say it's your size. Yeah. But then the, no, the place that the is on the <laughs> It will be like this. <laughs> and you know, you'll not be wondering that because it's a plot or anything. No, no, that's what they tell you that it is not, you're not supposed to wear. It's supposed to be taken off. The one so I actually, bizarre. quite frankly, have never understood is explain to me why I am doing like a DIY project on this garment. You first clip it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It. Clip it to Only for some place. idiots to come I think this is time for you to tear everything. <laughs> Excuse me. I want you to unbutton it this thing one by one. <laughs> one by each by each. You are crazy. Anyway, what else has been going on? I don't know. What's your plan for this podcast this year? Do you have a plan? Yes, I do. Okay. What's the plan? More shows. Meaning? I also don't want us to pay for anything. That is actually... <laughs> let me tell you something. Uh, I have a number that I want this podcast to give me this year. A number. And mm. that's it. Anything less than that. I'm not doing this podcast next yeah. year. Let me just inform you. So I want it to be bigger more fun I think that's it like, a part of me almost wants us to so last year was really good um, numbers wise and stuff but I miss a lot of not that we don't have the luxury anymore because we can do whatever we want but it was really really fun when we used to do most of the episodes it was just do you think so? Up. yes Really? Do you know yeah. people say this thing and I'm always like it was really I like I love I love having guests so I mean I don't listen to, to us don't get me wrong <laughs> but like I'm always like really? You don't No, I love having guests, whether celebrity or otherwise. But my a friend of mine who just 
has always supported in theory, just never in practice. Started listening from the beginning and she would message me like, oh my God, you guys said this is so funny. And then I just realized that like, it started becoming more insightful <laughs> as she was going down like, oh wow, you know, this really made me think about this. And Which that's is not nice. what I want. Is this? Which is not, no, it's nice. But, but I, I, I realized that, a damn I realized that because, I we have, that because we have guests, it can't just be okay. Yeah, we can't be saying rubbish yes, anymore. It can't sure, be, it can't be just sure. So I really quite, and I think maybe that's why I enjoyed the live shows. Yeah, because, because you can't just have, do rubbish. It's just the two of us. Yeah. Um, Actually, yeah, I don't mind that. I think this year I want to have a lot. Not, not that I don't have anything against celebrities, but I want to have a lot more just generally interesting people. Mm. Like how they just have an interesting like, like life Toby. story, like a hair, like <laughs> Toby. Shout out to Toby. Toby. And not necessarily like a, a celebrity, like somebody that, oh, this has happened to them. Yeah, they or, have a really interesting uh, life experience. I think that is mm-hmm. a lot. Well, for Misha, that's a lot more fun than the kind of interview time. Also because, because it's a weird thing, but like, so what attracts people is the idea that you can kind of be yourself on the platform. Yes. But sometimes when celebrities come on, they're still celebrities. Exactly. So they can't yeah. still And let me tell you something, people they fear. Yeah. It was this Christmas that I realized <laughs> that all more mans are afraid. I can't, I went to an event and there were a lot of these celebrities there and someone came to me and said, you know the thing? I've always wanted to say that, ah, okay, put me on your podcast now, but more. the guy said, I'm more fear. That's how you guys would just ask me one thing that I'll just be looking I said, apparently you guys don't do prep. You don't send out questions to no, your manager. I said, yeah, your manager should get out. No, I'm very don't. stupid. I said, you're not even that popular. You get manager. <laughs> very useless, boy. Anyway, what else have I enjoyed? Problems? I enjoyed, have enjoyed seeing, I went out and I saw someone wearing that. that I saw what I said. Yes, outfit. that's always nice. That's always very nice. Oh, yes, I want us to do merch this year. Different yes, merch. I think we should. Yeah, really cool. Merch. I think we should do more merch. merch. That's really it. Yeah. Okay, you people's problems. <laughs> because we're back. It's a new year and none of you have changed. Oh, no, there was. Some. I thought all of you were going to kind of grow up, no, move no, no, forward. No. no, actually, before we do that, please pan this camera to Michael Jackson. Do you know that today, this Michael Jackson walked in, right? <laughs> he now has a second, by the way. <laughs> They've given Michael Jackson a junior brother. <laughs> now, we're going to call him Billie Jean. <laughs> now, Michael Jackson, this is Billie Jean. Just introducing Billie Jean. This is Michael Jackson. Now, Michael Jackson, I, he came here today and I said, ah, is this what you are wearing for the people? Mind you, they promoted Michael Jackson. He said he's doing something, something ahead of content. Mm-hmm. Anyway, I asked him that, oh, so is this what you are wearing for the people on this podcast? He now says to me, oh, he thought that was just last season. Oh, he's, he's too no big for us now. No, 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 because mm-hmm. they've called him, you know, he, he won net. Mm. in next shit entered to in drink Lagos yeah no he entered Vogue mm. since then he has been hosting one or two events mm. and now he's too big for us and now people like know people like do you know what I mean people are calling people, Michael Jackson people like on the know road. him and he so just apparently feels like brand he wise he doesn't think that he can be him. part of us anymore because quite frankly who are FK and Jola you guess, should be on their little guess. podcast so just, I, I do you know and I get it life always has to yeah you have to grow no go ahead try it let's no, no, see no. Let's I see. think you should feel free I think you should go ahead. Let's see. So no worry. So anyway, you guys, that's the end of Michael Jackson. He said he's not doing it again. So um he's not a big boy. Mm. So um are you re- are you ready? Are you ready? Sure. The first person's name is Awe. <laughs> oh E-W-E. No, no, no. I know the, the exact way. many wise. And their line is their problem is one line. What's it? And I understand why they give themselves that name. My ex wants back all the money he gave me when we were dating. <laughs> <laughs> she said her ex wants all the away. money so her neck is away okay don't give him that's actually just the moral of the story I don't like thieves <laughs> and what I'm also do is a criminal activity oh gosh. so because they broke up you know what she should say to him that, you know that video of Papa saying that you are cheap yes and I know that I don't have this money I'm not going to pay back because you are cheap and you don't have class yes that's what you're going to tell him <laughs> And just walk away. That man is cheap and he doesn't have class. Because meaning what? I wonder how that conversation would go. I would just tell you, okay, no problem. No, how would that conversation go? Like, how would someone ask you? you say, I don't like, know. It sounds like, you know, when something pains you, eh, yeah, yeah, that yeah. you just start thinking, I know what I'm going to do for you. He probably just said to her, all this, I've calculated it now. This is how much you owe me. Mm-hmm. All this dinner that we went to, see the price, see the price. All this, this one that you said that you want ice cream, you want this, you want that. I We bought this. All right. Um, our next person is Emily B. 
who says, hi, I'm just going to jump right in. Just going to jump. Gonna okay. I'm going to jump right in. And she says, so I've been sleeping with my coworker for over a year now. <laughs> We're both single Pringles, but no one wants love. And she wrote, that's how she wrote the love. Love. It's all calm and good for the most part. But see, high key, this man is mad. I mean, all men are mad, but you know, I mean, she also wrote think about Kanye right now. Right. But let's not get into that. Always throwing one tantrum or the other. You see why this love thing can't click. Silent treatment, full baby tantrums, oh, and I am tired. But two years into a panini, and who has the energy to be babying a man that isn't even my end point? Oh, you, okay, after two, okay. okay you didn't no, no, know. no, 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 let's just keep going. I want to end things, but the sex high key bangs, and boo boo's Nigeria is hard. Do you know who has No, time? we haven't finished. Oh, okay, sorry. As the soft babe I am, every time I see him at work, I just want to bend over the table. <laughs> how does one get over a guy sexually who I can't block and I have to see five days a week do you know who has time to baby a man Emily B <laughs> because <laughs> Emily B and the B is for she, what baby buffoon <laughs> <laughs> let me tell you something she has time to baby this man <laughs> Emily B has been doing it for two years two years so I don't know how she's actually an expert <laughs> She's, an she's running a crash. She's actually running a nursery inside that office. That what Emily B is doing. <laughs> Unknown to her. She's, she's a, a headmaster. She's a principal. <laughs> she is crazy. Have you ever worked with people who have just recently stopped sleeping together? Yeah, very recently. Oh, because you got, I'm like, do you know that everyone knows? Oh my Jesus. There is nothing more passive aggressive. <laughs> and the funniest thing is that a lot of the time they take nobody else knows they are sleeping together. And in the Meiji, two... You know, when you're the real fool, you're the real idiot. <laughs> Emily. Emily B. Emily. Emily. <laughs> Emily, baby. Do you know, I hate people, right? So I actually hate them. So her issue now is how does okay, she get over him sexually? Him, right? And no, ending things. It was 20 tant- tantrums. You, Freddy, you have three options. You have to be prepared for the tantrums no, that are about to be thrown No. Now. Let me tell you the first thing she has to do. She has to form an alliance with HR because that guy has to go. But yeah, that's all we have for you people with your many, many problems. Make sure you are subscribed to our YouTube channel. Yes. Or else again. Because the numbers on our like actual podcast are growing, the audio, which is yeah. what, obviously that's the core. But when I juxtapose, <laughs> as you can see, big English, when I juxtapose audio and video, that you people yeah. beg for, by the yeah. way. <laughs> Although, let me know, like, kind of like that the audio is growing. No, the, the audio will always be bigger than the video. Yeah. Always. But, and also, a lot of you who watch the video are actually not aware that there's audio. That there's an Do audio. You know that, that was a very funny thing that I see comments and I'm like, excuse me. Also, what is what some, are you doing here? Once so somebody said, the show so short, I'm like, you, I hope you realize this is not the No, the episode. somebody said that I feel like there are gaps in the conversation. <laughs> and I said, oh, uh, you're a new Sorry, lads. You're so cute. Checked. Anyway, guys, so let, you know, I want to say let us know who you want on the podcast, but then I also oh, don't no, they want, should. want them to, I don't want to know. No, what they, they should want tell to. us. You should tell us what, what stories you want yeah. Like, yeah, what's not necessarily like, like celebrities like or a person that you know xyz so much that they want us to do a new episode on um addiction okay like someone in recovery sure yeah i think Which we I should do, do yeah so let us know the kinds of episodes that you want and i mean we're back so stop complaining we are about to take over <laughs> <laughs>